New at 630. Ever wonder what it's like to actually be behind the wheel of a police cruiser? One Mid-State Police Department is the first to have one, and they're using it to teach emergency crews how to drive. Our Mark Bellinger went to Murfreesboro's Police Department to try it out. This is the Murfreesboro Police Department's corrective driving course. Officers who have been in accidents come here for a refresher and safe driving. There's lots of action outside. But the real action is inside. Stolen vehicle. The police department hired the Tennessee Fire Service and Codes Academy to put officers through a new state-of-the-art driving simulator. It's as real as it gets. Murfreesboro is the first department to try it out. You start the car, turn on the lights and sirens, and move out. Officer Skyler Harris showed us how it's done. People aren't seeing you, so stopping at the intersections is is good practice here because as quick as those cars are coming, that's just as quick as they can come in real life. This is serious business. It's tricky going down the wrong way of the street and driving through red lights. Instructor Charlie Armstrong says students should expect the unexpected. You're looking at the computer, look, you know, the directions, run the siren and lights, constantly looking at traffic. Uh, it's a great responsibility. I gave it a try. You're sitting at this intersection watching for traffic violations at the intersection. It's a lot harder than it looks. This is uh, pretty realistic. This one's a Oh, that's the one I'm after. Sorry. I don't even know what car I'm after. Okay. It's also very stressful. We now have a report that this vehicle was used in a kidnapping earlier today. Finally, a three and a half minute pursuit, which seemed a lot longer, was over. I don't know where I, where should I position the vehicle in this situation? Well, these guys, and to be honest, probably in a, you would get closer and in a position to, to block and protect yourself. I was proud not to wreck the patrol car, but on one occasion I lost sight of the vehicle I was pursuing. Murfreesboro officers are taught to end the pursuit if that happens. It was close, but you did a good job. In what are sometimes life and death situations, the bottom line is to put as few people in danger as possible. We're trying to get there as safely as we can. If we don't get there, how can we help them? In Rutherford County, Mark Bellinger, News Channel 5 HD.